Selma, tell us a little bit about your digital empowerment program. Yes, thank you. This is a, a new initiative as well. And it's basically taking used computers. Uh, you know, so many of us, I'm sure, have computers collecting dust in our basement or, or <laughs> garage. We collect those computers and we refurbish them. We have this amazing team of, uh, of volunteers who love to tinker with computers and breathe new life into uh, desktops and laptops. And, uh, and then we share those with students and with families in need. There is such a need right now to stay connected. And it's incredible how many people don't have basic tools to work, to study, and just to stay connected with each other. And we provide these computers to those um, students and to families who are in dire need of computers. It's an amazing way to, to, to take what's already there, to uh, refurbish and reuse and recycle, and then to share it with, with people in need. How would we go about doing that? Because I have so many computers that I don't use anymore, and they're just sitting, like you said, sitting in your yes. basement. Yes. How would one, especially in this pandemic, how do we get those items safely to you? Absolutely. Just please write to us um, at info at dukindworks.org. The information is on our website. Visit our website. You will see uh, an email address there. Please write to us and we will get connected and find a safe way to gather those computers and to really quickly turn them around for people in need. And I'll just share one quick story. We, we uh, heard uh, a, a teenage boy who had to drop out of school recently because his father went into coma and he needed to be there to support his family. We heard about uh, the situation. We got a refurbished computer to him. He's now preparing for his GEDs. He's planning to go on to college and he wants to use that computer to record his music. So, oh, you know, nice. within a few days, we're able to turn around and, and hopefully change uh, someone's life. That's great information to know. Thank you.